In this video, I'll show you how to write an equation for an ellipse whose center is at the origin. The question reads, write the equation of an ellipse with the center at the origin 0 and 0, whose major axis is 12 units long on the y-axis, and the minor axis is 10 units. We are told that the major axis is 12 units long on the y-axis. This means that this ellipse will be stretched vertically as opposed to horizontally. That also tells us that the larger of the two denominators, notice that the standard equation of an ellipse looks like this, the larger of the two numbers will be underneath the y. Let's start by writing out the two things that they've provided us. They've told us that the major axis is 12, and to find the semi-major, which will serve as our a, you take this number and you divide it by 2. So dividing 12 by 2 will give you your a term, and in our case, that's 6. Now just to give you an understanding of what we just found, I'll draw an ellipse for you. So I've gone ahead and drawn an ellipse where it is stretched vertically. And what we just found, a, represents the distance from here to the distance here. That's your a. 12 represented the distance from here all the way to here. Now our minor axis, as mentioned in the question, is 10. The minor axis is the distance from here to here. I know it's not the scale, but it's a good representation nonetheless. So from here to here is 10, and to find b, that's a distance from here all the way to here. I'm going to write down b and write down a. So what we have to do is divide this by 2, and we get 5. This is our a, and this is our b. Next, what I'll do is substitute these values into my formula where I end up with y squared over 6 to the power of 2 is 36 plus x squared over 5 to the power of 2 is 25 is equal to 1. And there you have it. That is how to write an equation for an ellipse whose center is at the origin. 